Today in this video, I'm gonna discuss some rules, do's and don'ts about buttons in mobile UI designing. In mobile UI designing, button is a very important element because it communicates with the user to make actions. This video is going to be very informative for you. So let's start with the first type of button. Text button. It just consists of a simple text. It is used for less emphasis, where less importance is required like in notifications, pop-ups. Here is an example. Text buttons are often used in guards and dialog boxes because text buttons are independent from outlined and filled containers so they don't disrupt from other content. It can be used on left or side it is your choice. Here is another example. Outline buttons. Outlined buttons are used in medium emphasis. Here are examples. The button's height and width should dynamically fit with the labeled text. Here is another state of the outline button called rest button. It should be used at the bottom of the screen, dialog box and cards. Here is a tip for you. Use the outline button on images, instead of using contained and text buttons. The third type is contained button which is filled with some color. Contained buttons are used in higher emphasis. Here are some examples. Talking about the buttons, you can also use icons in the buttons. but try to use stroked icons. You can make the rectangle 50% rounded. Now let's talk about shadows. You can use shadow in contain buttons to make the button look more effective. Now, coming to the most important part of this video, do's and don'ts. Avoid very long text labels in buttons. Don't use two or more contained buttons in the same line. Use one for medium emphasis and other for higher emphasis. Don't place a button below another if there is space to place them side by side. The container's width, as well as height, should dynamically fit with the length of the labeled text. Don't use more than one icons in a button. If you want to keep boosting your designing skills then subscribe to Creative Tracks. Thanks. I hope this video was informative for you.